students, good day. This is Teacher Ray again, Teacher Reynaldo, I'm back. And for today's lesson in health, we are going to learn about feet and foot care. Okay, can you repeat after me? Feet and foot care. Okay, this is what we are going to study for today's lesson. Okay, but before anything else, as what we did last time, we will do first our vocabulary. Okay, so here, as you can see, I prepared three words for you to learn today. Okay, so please don't forget to repeat after teacher. Number one, protect, protect, protect. Spell P R O T E C T. P R O T E C T. Protect. Protect. Good job. Number two. Smell. 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 Spell. S. M. E. L. L. S. M. E. L. L. Smell. Smell. Good job. Number three. Awful. 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 Spell. A. W. F. U. L. A. W. F. U. L. Awful. Awful. Very good. Okay. So before anything else, please get your health book and open it to page 19. Again, get your health book and open it to page 19. Okay, are you now ready? Very good. Okay, so here, kindly repeat after teacher, feet and foot care. Again, feet and foot care. Feet need to be washed often. Again, feet need to be washed often. So you have to wash your feet, okay, often. And next, take care to dry your feet properly. Okay, as you can see here, I will repeat, take care to dry your feet properly after washing or bathing. So when you wash your feet, you have to dry it properly, okay? You can also use towel to dry your feet actually, okay? Next here. Shoes protect your feet. Again, shoes protect your feet. Okay, so this is very important. Um, using your shoes, that will protect your feet against any um, animals that could harm you. Say, for example, the snake. The snake might bite you if you didn't have shoes. So that's very important. The shoes would protect your feet. Next, shoes must 
fit properly. Okay, so you have to choose shoes that will fit to your feet or foot. Okay, because if your shoes are not good in size or shall we say fit to your feet, ah, oh, it's not good to use. You cannot walk properly and you cannot also run properly. Okay, I will repeat. Shoes protect your feet and shoes must fit properly. Okay, please remember that one, that the purpose of wearing your shoes is to protect your feet. And you must also uh, use shoes that fit to your feet properly. Okay, next, wear clean socks daily. Okay, so you have to wear clean socks daily because you know why? If you don't wear clean socks, oh, what will happen to your socks? Say for example, your, you wore your socks on Monday and you wore it again on Tuesday until Friday. So what will happen? Your socks becomes smell awful, smell bad, okay? So clean socks smell nice and dirty socks smell awful, okay? Can you repeat after me? Clean socks smell nice and dirty socks smell awful. So you have also to wash your socks after using it, okay? So do not uh, use it many times. Don't use it often, that's not good, okay? And before we proceed to our activities, we have to remember all the things that we have studied today. Okay, so first, how are we going to care our feet properly? Yes, of course, you have to wear your shoes when you go to school or when you go somewhere so that your feet will be protected by your shoes against any harmful animals like snake. Okay, and also you have to wear clean socks and do not wear dirty socks because that's not good. That is smell awful or smell bad. So you have to wash also your socks after using it. And then please remember that you have to wear socks clean every day. Okay, so let's proceed to our activities. And here, I want you to open your health book to page 20. I repeat, open your health book to page 20. Okay, look at the instruction here. Join the pictures and sentences with much. Again, join the pictures and sentences with much. Okay, look at here. And number one, they are uh, drying their foot, okay? Or drying their feet. If there are two, that's what we call feet, that is plural form, but only one, that is foot, okay? Here, so is it wash your feet or dry your feet? Wear clean socks or wear shoes that fit properly? And the next, is it wash your feet, dry your feet, wear clean socks, wear shoes that fit properly? Okay, so you have to draw a line to match. Okay, next, look at this one, the number three. Is it wash your feet? Is it dry your feet? Wear clean socks, wear shoes that fit properly? Okay, so you have to think about it. And the last, is it wash your feet, dry your feet, clean, wear clean socks, and or wear shoes that fit properly, okay? So I hope that you can answer 
this correctly. And next, on page 21, you have to tick or check the statements that describe how we can care for our body. Again, you have to tick or check the statements that describe how we can care for our body. Okay, number one, I wipe my eyes gently instead of rubbing them. So is it good? Are we going to check that? You have to think about it. Number two, I pick my ears with toothpicks. Is it good? So you have to think about it. Number three, I use clean tissue paper to wipe my nose. Again, I use clean tissue paper to wipe my nose. Is it good? Okay. So number four, I do not comb my hair. I do not comb my hair. Okay, is it good? Number five, I rinse my mouth after meals. I rinse my mouth after meals. Okay, so you have to think about it. Next, number six, I use toothpaste when I brush my teeth. Again, I use toothpaste when I brush my teeth. Are we going to put check on it? You have to think about it. Okay, number seven. I do not wear shoes of the wrong size. I do not wear shoes of the wrong size. Okay, is it true? Okay, number eight. I use socks that smell awful. I use socks that smell awful. Okay, is it true? Number nine, shoes must fit properly. Shoes must fit properly. Okay, number 10 or last number. We use shampoo to wash our hand. We use shampoo to wash our hand. And that's all for today. I hope that you can answer everything. And don't forget to um, take a photo and send it to our line, okay? So that we can check your work. And thank you for listening. Bye-bye.